Hey baby dolls, it's me Monique and welcome to my boutique. And so how are y'all doing? So I'm like, I've got to think of some things to be creative, right? It's like I can't go travel to my favorite islands this summer. Unfortunately, we are on semi-quarantine. So I thought what I could do is I could possibly bring some of the countries to me right bring the mountain to Mohammed if you will right and so this is going to be a tasting of various treats and snacks that I've never had before and I thought you know what let's go ahead and sample them together and so before we get started I want to say hello to all of my new baby dolls I am your host Monique aka Modiva how are you doing and hello to my baby dolls that have been with me for a while y'all know I love you but God loves you so much more pretty is it's pretty does and so let's go ahead and get into this and so I've got a, a wide variety of little things that we'll be sampling today I'm not gonna hold you too long but I thought you know what let's have a little bit of fun in the boutique this afternoon I haven't had lunch a little hungry so let's go ahead and use some calories on some snacks from around the world all right, so I've already taken the liberty of opening this one up already. This is the Shrimp Crackers, and from this company called Nongshim, and I know that I'm pronouncing this incorrectly, but I got these at Big Lots for $1.25. I did notice that they are from Korea, and so this makes it legitimate, and I love the packaging. Love that packaging, looks so cute. And I love the Asian lettering here. And when I open this bag, it's very, very shrimpy. Thus, shrimp crackers. That is Coney in the background if you hear him. And so let's go ahead and sample one. So the first thing I immediately think of is like cheese puffs, but they don't have cheese on them. Very fishy. Okay, here we go. Do that to taste the shrimp. On a scale from one to five, with five being high, I would already thus far give these probably a two because it's really not a lot of taste to it. I'm thinking maybe if we were to dip this into some hot chili sauce or drizzle a little bit of soy sauce. But it's a simple little, a little cracker. So we'll give it a two. It is what it is. Let's try it out. You know, you just never know. And so I'm going to, I need a little drink here. So this is my um, Ultra Ocean Spray Pink Cranberry Juice. And I've already poured some. And I'm actually having this with. A little bit of ice cream. Mm-hmm. And it's already melting. But this is the Sour Patch Icicles. Okay. And then I just kind of mixed it in here. Mm. Now this is good. Mm-hmm. Now, that's American. I would give that a five out of five stars. If you go to the Dollar Tree, pick these up. They are so good. And so do mine. Okay, next thing. Um, I got these at the Dollar General. Now, these are called Pulp, pulp Morindos. Hot and Salted Tamarind Pulp Bar with real fruit from Della Rosa says that it's 50 calories per bar this is what it looks like I guess maybe that's like the little tamperand um, nut or fruit or something and let's go ahead and read what this says 
where are we going today? So this is a product of Jalisco, Mexico. So we're traveling to Mexico. Put your seatbelts on, ladies and gentlemen. You're in for a long ride here. It says a long time ago, people from Asia and Latin America consumed tamarind fruit because of its unique flavor and nutritional properties. Well, already, we're loving that product of Asia and Mexico and you get lots of little bars in here I love how they're individually wrapped let's just move this over here this is cute oh my gosh how unique have y'all ever had this let's go ahead and try this out I've never had this before what is this I was thinking like a fruit roll-up or something. That's what I was thinking that it would be. Um, no. This is not a fruit roll-up. This is what it looks like. It's got like a little sugar or something on there. Ooh. Ooh. This smells like molasses. Brown sugar and cigar because my husband smokes cigars and so this smells maybe chewing tobacco uh oh okay let's try let's do it for a real taste girl I'm doing this for you baby dolls oh my gosh okay here we go and I'm not gonna just take a little bite I'm gonna take a big bite to get the full effect, okay? I'm gonna do that for you, girl. Oh, God. Ooh, this is strong. But hey, it's supposed to be a delicacy of Asia and Mexico. So here we go. Cheers to you, okay. Oh my god <laughs> oh my goodness girl I've never my teeth <coughs> you hear me in here calling girl oh. mm. Let me kind of compose myself. I wasn't expecting that. That was, oh my gosh. That was salty. That was spicy. Salty, spicy, sweet, gritty, sour. Coney. That's Coney in there. I don't know what's going on with him. I guess he's crying because he thinks that something's wrong with me, but um, that was unique in a good way. Very, <coughs> very unique. Would I purchase this again? Probably just for the unique factor. On a scale from one to ten, I mean one to five, with five being high, I'm going to go ahead and give this a four for sure. I mean, that was some deep, deep, <coughs> it's like a couple little grains of the <coughs> is in my throat. Okay, <laughs> moving on along, girls, where are we going now? And so then I got these. And so again, these came from the Dollar General for $1. This came from Big Lots. For a dollar fifty, and the packaging had me at hello, and I have a different style of this too. And this is called um, Dolceso Black Angel Cake, filled with strawberry and vanilla artificial cream. 
five individually wrapped packages from Vicky Foods, and this is from Spain, from Valencia, Spain. So let's go ahead and go to Spain, girl. Oh my gosh. Yes, yes, yes. We'll open the package up. And oh yeah, this is going to be, oh my goodness. This is going to be fabulous with coffee. Oh, they're so adorable. Look at that. Yes, how beautiful that is. Individually wrapped, girl. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're getting a little fancy now. We're getting fancy, so let's go ahead and open this up. clutch my fake pearls yes I can already tell this oh it's so beautiful and stunning oh my gosh brilliant look at that let's go ahead we could have these for with our tea for sure I just love the pink and the yellow and the ice cream that like makes me happy okay it smells so good, so vanilla-y, so strawberry, so icing-y. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. Can you? Here we go. Let's go to Brazil. Is that where it's at? Brazil? Or do we say Spain? Oh no, let's go to Spain, girl. Oh yeah, this is fancy and lovely and amazing, and I love it. Mmm. I'm in Spain right now. I hope you are too. Mm -hmm. Five out of five, girl. For sure. Mm-hmm. Very sweet. The texture is is a cake texture, yet it's kind of got a little stiffness to it. It's not too overly sweet, which I love. I love it's just a very fancy, dainty dessert. It's aesthetically pleasing. The flavors are true. And I would say that if you want to impress anybody in your life, any of your friends, if you want to just have fun and have a cute little girl's day in, get these in your life, girl. They are amazing. I love them. Winning thus far. I, I love that a lot. Okay. Let's see. What are we? Doing? Where are we gonna go now? It's a lot of sugar. All right. Now we've got some peanut candy marzipan style six pieces. Della Rosa. The packaging had me at hello with those beautiful roses. Okay. This is another product of Mexico. I got these at the Dollar General for one dollar, girl. So, let's see. Oh, these are beautiful. This is, they come like this. Wow. So pretty and fancy. I love it. Marzipan Original. And I love that beautiful rose. All right. And I love that it's individually wrapped. I've never had marzipan. And so it just kind of broke up as I was opening it. So, oh, it's still breaking up. Kind of looks like fudge. Ooh, very peanutty. 
Bye bye. Wow. This stuff is just like boom. Broke up a mount. Mm. Lots of little peanuts in here, little tiny pieces of peanuts. Mm. It's like a it's like a creamy powdered sugar tasting candy. It's very good. Mm, it melts in your mouth. It melts in your mouth. This is very good. Mhm. Mm I like. I love it. Very peanutty, but on a light level. Little teeny bits of peanut. Um, this is the bomb. Translation. It's good. I'm going to give that a 5 out of 5, too. Okay? Um, next thing, this is called Benrindo Candies. I got these from the Dollar General. Never had these. Have no idea what it is. Let's put some glasses on. This is another product of Mexico. Huh. It's a product of Mexico. Can't read Spanish. But. What is that? Looks like it was kind of open a little bit. It doesn't matter though because they're individually wrapped. So. Get our little scissors. Open it up. Now they have, oh no, they're all the same. Huh, I have no idea what these are, okay. But they're individually wrapped. Looks like we're doing a lot of traveling to Mexico today. Oh my, I just opened this thing up and I don't know what it is. It kind of looks like a Coke bottle, okay. I don't know what it smells like because I've never smelled this before. So, and it's shiny. I don't know if it's chocolate or what, or if it's hard. It feels like it's hard. Can't bite it. You have to just suck it. Let's see. I can't tell you what this tastes like. Because I've never tasted this. It's sweet. It's not chocolatey. It's not caramelly. It almost has like a little perfumey taste. Like perfume. I have no clue, girl. I can't crunch down on it. It's just candy. It's sweet, a little tangy, and it tastes like one of my perfumes back there. <laughs> I would give this a one. It's good, but I don't know what I'm tasting. Okay, so there's that one. <laughs> I don't know what I'm tasting. <laughs> but hey. Just because we're traveling to different parts of the country doesn't mean that you're going to like every single thing that you try. Was it nasty? No. I just, it tastes like perfume. So there we go. All right. So 
What is this? Does anybody, has anybody tried these? I mean, what is it supposed to taste like? I can't give a review on it because I really don't, I just taste the perfume. All right, so last but not least is another product of Spain. This one is the Cheesecake. Look how beautiful that is. And again, this is the product of Spain. This was $1.50. From Big Lots. Again, there we go. Let's see it together. Oh boy. Oh, these are amazingly cute. Look at that. That's pink and cream. I smell this out the package. this girl get out of here get get out of here get out of here cheesecake girl I smell cheesecake in the house in the boutique okay I'm scrunching it up these are so adorable I guess y'all can tell what what's what is my favorite out of this whole situation girl it's going to Spain yes we already know I'm trying to open this up so I don't okay here we go it's going to Spain girl here we go Yes, girl. Get these in your life. Ten stars. Ten stars. Do you hear me? One more bite. Mmm. Mmm. Delicate. Creamy, sweet, beautiful, delightful. Got a little bit of cream and a little bit of jelly. Cheesecake. I love it. You'll love it. I love you. <laughs> But God loves you so much more. I've had a fabulous time with y'all trying these different things from across the world. I've got enough sugar now to fly high. Looks like I got a call. We'll have to answer that in a minute. Um, but yeah, I had a really, really good time with y'all. Y'all, get out to your stores. Try some international things. Um, experiment. Do things that are different. So at least, you know... You can say that you've tried it. You can say if you like it, if you don't like it. But hey, you never know unless you try, right? So I love you, but God loves you so much more. Remember that pretty is as pretty does. And I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.